Hello everyone, take a 50 ml syringe. Draw the piston to suck some air inside the syringe. Now, block the outlet of nozzle with the finger. Now, push the piston. You will be able to push it, but it will be harder to push it fast. Now, there is air inside. This means air is highly compressible. Now, take some water or any liquid instead of air in the syringe. It would be much harder to push the piston now, which means liquid is not very compressible compared to gases. The reason is quite simple actually. We already know that when we turn liquid into gas, the distance between the molecule increases. As there is a large space between molecules, the gas is very compressible. You must be knowing that we can cook for a whole month or at least 2 or 3 weeks using one LPG cylinder for a family of 4 on an average. We burn a lot of gas every time we cook. Yet it goes on for that long. How is the gas filled in a LPG cylinder? Propane or butane gas is compressed using so much pressure that it becomes liquid and then it is filled into the cylinder. This means very high pressure can bring the molecules closer and the gas turns into a liquid. Have you ever heard of dry ice? It is solid carbon dioxide. The gas is turned into solid by applying very high pressure and low temperature. And when the pressure is decreased, dry ice evaporates very fast and turns into carbon dioxide. We already know that the temperature is the reason for the change of state of matter. A solid requires heat in order to change the state into liquid. When a solid is heated, it turns into liquid at a certain temperature. This process is called melting or fusion. When a liquid is heated, it turns into gas at a certain temperature and we call this process vaporization. Now, Upon cooling, the gas turns into liquid through condensation process and the liquid turns into solid in solidification process. But all that happens in these processes is either increasing or decreasing the space between the molecules. Right? And now we know the pressure can force molecules to come closer causing the change of state too. This process is useful in many scenarios. For example, lots of gas can be filled in deodorant bottle, LPG cylinder, etc. using this compression. The gas stays in liquid state but the state is reversed when the pressure is withdrawn. That's all for now. Bye-bye.